All right, it's getting nice and warm. And you know what's cool about having like uh, three channels? I got three channels, did I? And sometimes I'm on a fourth channel. Um, what channel are you guys in? In the politics channel? You in the football team channel? You in the it's not fair, I'm the victim, or those people are victims. And I, I'm, I'm acknowledging that they're victims, right? Welcome to Stretch in the Spirit, YouTube edition. This is not live, but it's free. <laughs> like it if you see it, if you don't like it, you know, whatever, so move the fuck on. Move the fuck on. If you can't push a fucking button, just go when you're pathetic. If you like it, like, I don't want those people around. I'd rather just be me in the sun on the fucking earth, man. Let's go. Let's play. You guys are wasting the time. You don't get this. You don't get this. You don't get it. So, I was thinking about, you know, a friend of mine's talking about, really, really changed my, uh, my perspective open my heart to my ego and uh, it just so rings true that it is it is heart energy and it's expression and um, you know a lot of people just the ego and um, the people that I really respect and I just want to have a shout out to um, all the creators that I follow whether you know it or not whether you care or not it doesn't matter but energetically <laughs> I, I'm just seeing everybody up their game and that is the reaping you know what have you sown? So I'm really feeling that in this Virgo season. I'm not sure what the moon is. It might be in Capricorn still, so that's why I'm highly judged. Even though it's my son, but nonetheless, it's an energy. And this waxing moon. So yeah, I was thinking about ego, and, and this woman's like, basically, connection with God is lack of ego. And I'm like, you know what? I respectfully disagree because, um, I think it is connection to God. <laughs> and I was like, you know, I appreciate your work, sister. You're doing amazing. You have a very sacred purpose and your work is sacred. And, uh, oh, I saw a bird with a peanut in its mouth. I love that. So I wrote it over my head before I started this video. A good sign. So yeah, you know, I, I don't want to like, um, I mean, I didn't think ego was good either, right? And I've just like, had my aperture open about it. And uh, you know where you are, so thank you if you watch these. And I used to love uh, taking photos. I took photos in uh, high school. I took a photography class and Mr. Chang, I'm super cool. Photography teacher, you know, he's like, you have a good eye. I'm like, I do? <laughs> I do, 100%. I do love taking photos as a hopefully I can represent to you guys. Those are all just usually, I don't know, sometimes I go back to some old ones, but it's just such a great way to catch a moment, right? And that's beautiful. Like, that's. Is that Aquarian? Especially now, right? You're watching me right now. How cool is this shit? So yeah, ego, and I was thinking about how everybody's so all bent out of shape about this one guy. Oh, he has such a huge, ginormous ego, you want him dead. People literally want him to die. That's an interesting one to hold. Let me go flood my, go irrigate my spine here a little bit. Gotta flip my head here and do that. Get on my way. I have been thinking of cutting my hair off. Super short. I've done it quite a few times. And some even had a tail. My husband was not a fan, so I said, I don't really care. Just chopped it off, because it went from long to short. Like, that's how I roll. That's how I got engaged, too. We weren't even officially boyfriend or girlfriend, because I said, I'm not your girlfriend. I know if I'm your girlfriend, I'm going to marry you. 
So that went on for a while. It was an off and on thing. He, uh, he definitely was pursuing and I was definitely like, you know, a little break on trail. But it took me being a <laughs> in ecstasy. It's not the way that like, uh, you know, man and woman, not, not that way, because it's like, woo, whatever it was, pill. Um, but no, it was super cool. And uh, <laughs> anyway, that's when I was like, yeah, I love you. <laughs> he did it. He did it. He's like, really? I'm like, yes, yes, you do. Yes. <sighs> He's like, do you want to get married? I'm like, might as well. <laughs> as well because I predicted the shift and it's been great and it was just our 25th anniversary so uh, we are no longer together and have been apart since uh, I I you know what it was I think it was when I took my diamond ring off and then didn't have it on for a long time and it wasn't really thought I think I just took it off because it was like tight or something maybe I had a bunch of chips one night I'm like ow took it off and I just never put it back on so that that hole, that that magic, that magical token, that spell, that crystal, and I learned recently that diamonds do not conduct anything, something like that. Like they, they don't conduct. I'm not sure if I'm saying that right, but but quartz does. Silica, like what's in our phone? Like that's a great conductor because it has a a flaw. I mean. You guys are even interested, or I'm gonna, I'm a bunch of pussies. <laughs> you want to ask like, I wonder what she's talking about. I'm just gonna make up like what in my mind what I think it is, because I can't actually like wonder and you know actually whatever it doesn't matter. Anyway, if you're interested, I'll send you a link if I can figure it out. Anyway, crystals are very magical, as are trees. Look at this conductor right here. I actually peed her like 10 minutes ago. And that's magic, you guys. I'm not gonna drink my pee, but I'll pee in my places. <laughs> and no plants are dying due to this urine. They are already on their way out. I am watering root here. My ancestor. And it's not like, oh, I'm eating it all organic. <laughs> I went to the store yesterday and I got chips, ice cream, Ben and Jerry's like seven layer um, non-dairy because I get a little, my tummy does get a little algae. Um, and so I got one free to my girls and uh, some chips and some bread and some stevia and I didn't even go to the fruit section. I was like, you know, I think we have an apple and a couple of bananas at home. You know, just that and my energy is going elsewhere. I used to spend a lot of time cooking and preparing meals and freezing stuff and I'm just like, you know what? That'll happen again, but I now understand why my, uh, you know, I had six brothers and sisters and our house was just always a chaotic mess, man. Six bedrooms, three bathrooms in the middle of a weed deal. <laughs> 360 square feet. And I think my mom was like, just doing more stuff like this. You know, rather than like trying to organize, you know, chaos. <laughs> She's like, you could do that or I could try and be present with my kids. And gift them with like magical things like painted ceramics and and uh, and, and dried flower arrangements and and me losing my shit with my husband in front of him. <laughs> I want them to witness this, Miss Queen of the Virgo season, my mother. Mmm, she is very powerful. Yes, mommy. When she died. 2009. At 69. Yes, I was born in 69. Well, actually, I was born in 69 and she was born in 39. I like, to, I like people who have nines at the end of their your year of birth for some reason. My husband was 1959. I'm like, hmm, I like that. I'm very into nine. Very into nine. I married a nine. It's weird. Like, you know, 
piece is coming in right now. That's interesting. Um, it's such a magical number. Holy shit. If you don't believe in God, just look into the number nine and tell me later what you think that's about. Oh, Ruth. What are you doing? This is a crazy video. That's right. Because I'm walking against the crowd. I'm swimming upstream. We're made to. My Venus is in Pisces. I'm a swimmer. My Capricorn has a tail. My Scorpio moon has a sting you. Better not put me on your back. <laughs> and oh, don't I love a toad, a frog. I used to catch them as a child and save them as tadpoles out of the above ground swimming pool and put them in the creek. So they can conti could continue become all right that's good all right i love you all have a real gorgeous aquarian morning my youtube channel people if you're here look at my look at my crystal sparkle winking at you i love you all namaste